Hi, I'm Lisa Henricks, and I'm a fiber and textile artist here at the Foundry Art Center in St. Charles, Missouri. And today I want to tell you about my exhibit, Material Alchemy, which is in the Ameristar Gallery downstairs. The work is based on the idea of alchemy, which was a medieval precursor to chemistry, where people tried to make base materials turn into gold. And the reason that I use that is because my work changes a lot as I work with it. And in this case, I spent a year experimenting with taking loose wool fiber and bonding it with paper, turning it into a beautifully textured textile that I can paint on and use as a really interesting surface for my work. I also spent the year experimenting with using inks and paints that I make, mostly from natural materials, which I incorporate into the work as well. The processes that I use in my work are really diverse and I spend different points during my day doing different things. In the mornings, I tend to do mark making and I will do acemic writing, which is writing without real meaning. I take those pieces and I tear them up and I incorporate them into the work as well. I maybe dye fabrics that I add in. At some point, I may be doing some rolling of felt, which is laying out loose fibers, combining them with water and soap and turning them into a fabric. Often after I have done that, I add other layers. I paint on my work, and I might be mixing paints in my studio. Often stitching goes into my work as well, which is a very meditative process for me. I spend time in the early part of the work and in the later part of the work adding stitches. So it's a very integrative process. I've been at the Foundry here now for about seven years, and this is a wonderful place to have a studio. The artists here are very supportive, as, as well as the staff. I've learned so many things from each of them about framing and about exhibiting artwork and how to hang an art exhibit and including my own exhibit here, which is my first exhibit downstairs. You know, I'm very grateful to have the opportunity to have put together an exhibit like this here at the Foundry. I hope when somebody goes in to see Material Alchemy, first they will notice the patterns and shapes, enjoy it as abstract artwork, and then I hope they go up and look closely at the textures and the very fine details that they might not see from a distance because the textures are beautiful. There's a lot of writing and small marks in the work, little pieces of fabric, things that may catch their interest only when they're close up. Another thing I would really like people to come away from the exhibit with is I'd like them to think about processes of alchemy in their own life that make them feel centered and whole. The exhibit continues through October 29th and you can find out more at the Foundry's website, foundryartcenter.org.